Hey everyone, I'm so pumped to announce that Arise Mortgage is expanding into the Korean community. I'm here today to welcome our newest team member of Arise Mortgage, Kevin Kim. And Kevin, welcome and we're really looking forward to working together with you. I know you're quite well known in the Korean community, but uh, some of our viewers may not know you, so perhaps you can tell us about yourself. Sure, um, let me start from my family background. Um, I'm from Korea. I moved to Canada in 2005. I graduated my high school and university in Vancouver, but decided to move back to Korea for five years. I enjoyed the time in Korea uh, with my family, but uh, me and my wife, we made a decision to uh, move back to Korea, uh, Canada to start a family. Um, so now I have a family with a boy who keeps me a little busy every day. Oh, I'm sure he keeps you up at night and keeps you really busy because I have a girl as well. But uh, why did you choose mortgage brokering? Well, I used to work as a military professional of ROK Army and also worked as an accountant for many corporations in Canada. Um, I really enjoyed the job itself, but to be honest, I always wanted to more and more. Um, um, I was not too sure what I was missing out, but hey, it turns out it's, it's my personality. I'm a, I'm a social person. I need to meet people, meet with um, others to be happy. So I chose uh, mortgage brokering, um, not only the job itself, but the fact that I can help people to make better financial decisions for their mortgages. And I know you're a hard worker and you probably spend a lot of time working, yeah. but outside of work, what do you enjoy doing? Outside of work, I usually go out with my family to the park or playground, sometimes two or three times in a day. So it's tough, but it's, it's very, um, it's very good. Okay, so we really want to get to know you a lot more. So what we're going to do is we're going to do a rapid fire question game where I'm going to ask you a series of questions. I want you to answer with the first thing that comes to your mind. Okay. So you ready? Yeah, sounds fun. All right, let's do this. So first question, who is your role model growing up? Wow, that's a good one. Uh, my role model is John Lee. As but John Lee, me. But other John Lee. Who's that? He is the uh, CEO of uh, one of the biggest asset management company in Korea. He inspired a lot of young generations to have a dream and run for it. I also got a lot of inspiration from it. I really appreciate uh, his uh, passion to share everything with the young generation. So I know you're an awesome man, but the other John. Okay, one of the reasons why I wanted you to be on my team is because I will get random calls mm -hmm. and when I pick up, they'll be like, I don't say all and they'll speak Korean. <laughs> yeah. And I'm like, why, why do people think I'm Korean? So I guess they've been Googling John Lee. Yes, absolutely. And apparently I guess John Lee is a very Korean name. He's a well-known <laughs> and very famous guy for sure. Okay. Next question. What is the best movie you've ever seen? Um, Matrix. Okay. That is my number one go-to movie. Um, I have a little story about uh, the movie itself. Um, my legal name in Korean is Taejin, but I had to come up with an English name when I was in high school. So I chose the name from uh, one of the movies that, that I watched on the, fl on the flight. Um, that Probably that was the first time I flew over to Canada. And guess what? I chose Neo. Yeah. So my name used to be Neo Kim. That's a pretty cool name, but at that time, I had no idea how much time I have to repeat my name, explain the entire story to everyone to make sure that they call my name right. So that was a little story, yes. Hey, this, this question, your, your Korean friends will definitely love. Okay. How many ways can you do the heart symbol? Oh, <laughs> I think I can do two. Two? All right. Obvious That's one it. is this. The second is this. Oh, you know what? I got something for you. Maybe this. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> love it. Yeah. And uh, I love Korean food. Okay. Where can I get the best Korean chicken? I'm getting this question quite a lot. I know everyone, uh, everyone is looking for a best Korean chicken right now. Mm -hmm. My answer is always firm. Check it out. The ribbon chicken in Langley. They're the best and they're the, they're the, they're the best Korean chicken place in the world. Wow, I will definitely check it out. Check it out. Which K-pop star would you want to be? Wow. If you had to choose. I never thought about it, but um, it would be cool if I can live like GD from Big Bang. 
Um, I know he's a super talented guy and he's a trendsetter, so that'll be awesome. And how about K-drama? My <laughs> wife loves K-drama. Okay. She watches it nonstop on Netflix. Do you have your favorite K-drama? This is easy. My favorite K-drama is Kingdom, period. That's the best. And how long did you spend watching it? Well, <laughs> I think I watched four episodes straight with my family. Wow. And how long is each episode? How about an hour. So total five hours straight watching on Netflix. Well, I, I, I still remember the conversation with my wife that I, I said, hey, we have six episodes to watch in a week. So one episode per day. And guess what? We watched the whole season in two days. And it's about, I hear it's about zombies, is it? It is. Yeah? yeah. All right. It's Korean traditional plus fantasy. So that's something interesting. And what's your favorite sport to watch? Um, I love to watch UFC. UFC? Oh, hey, me too. Oh, yeah. Love it. And mm. do you have a favorite fighter? Um, my favorite fighter is obviously the Korean zombie, Jung Chun Sung. <laughs> of course. And of course, zombie again. Something well, with you and zombies. <laughs> <laughs> Not too sure. I never thought about it. Um, but yeah, I guess so. And uh, well, if, if you can invite three famous people over for dinner, mm -hmm. who would you choose? Uh, first of all, I'd like to invite Steve Nash. Steve Nash. He is my all-time favorite NBA player, player for sure. Son Heung Min, also known as Sonny, he's, a, he's one of the best soccer player in the world right now. And the third one will be John Lee, but the other John Lee. Oh, yeah. Maybe one day I'll be cool enough. I know you're a cool guy, but yeah. <laughs> for this time, I'd like to have a dinner with John Lee, the other John. <laughs> Uh, and I guess this is the last question. Mm -hmm. What's one hidden talent that people may not know about? Um, I can play guitar, but just for fun. Okay. Can you show us some of your talent right okay. now? Okay. Um, my fingers are rusty, but I can try. All right. All right. And of course, you carry your guitar everywhere, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see. Oh, you're not screwing up. I don't think you did. Yeah, I missed the two core part. But, <laughs> but what I got. <laughs> thanks again for, for joining us, and that was a lot of fun. Thank you. So, for people watching and they want to get in touch with you for any more inquiries, so how would they contact you? Yeah, if you need my help and assistance, please email me at kevin at arisemortgage.ca or simply give me a call. I will answer you and I will make sure your mortgage get approved. Awesome. Thank you so much. Thank you, John.